Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Learn Haitian Creole. Today's video, we're covering law, okay, which is loi, or you can say the law, which is la loi. Bonjour tout le monde, bienvenue encore dans Apprendre Creole Haitien. Video aujourd'hui, on a couvri la loi, okay, loi, qui uh, c'est law, ou bien the law. Law in Creole uh, is loi, loi. Um, if someone is studying law, okay, we say doi, okay, they're studying doi, not loi. Loi, okay, the word loi also has another meaning in Creole. So when someone worship, let's say spirits, okay, th that spirit is also called loi in Creole. Loi, le n'a parlé de la loi, ok? Uh, en anglais, c'est law, ok? Law, le on a suivre ou supposé suivre loi, en pays, c'est law. The law, ok? Si n'a parlé de the law, nous dit la loi, la loi. Ok, presque même bagay la. The law, um, c'est la loi, ok? La loi, c'est the law. The word la loi, also means alo in English, okay? Like aloe vera, okay? It's it's la loi also, okay? La loi vle di alo en anglais too. The word crime, okay? When someone commits a crime, okay? In Creole, we say crime, crime, okay? Le on moun crime, en anglais nous di crime, okay? Crime. Yon témoin, so, un monde qui te ouais ça te passé à, ok? Y ont témoin. En anglais, c'est un witness, un witness, un monde qui te ouais ça te fait là. To testify, ok? In Creole, we say témoigner, témoigner. If you testify, you tell the judge what you saw. In Creole, témoigner. Le ou témoye, se le ou di sa ou te wè. Tak ou gen dwal nan tribunal, ou di juj la ki sa ou te wè. Ou témoigner. En anglais, testify. Ok? Testify, témoigner. A fine. Ok? Like you're driving, you take a red light, they give you a fine, they give you a ticket. Um, in Creole, we say aman. Ok? They make you pay an aman. The word fine also means bien in Creole, okay? Like if you feel well. Um, aman, la yo boyon aman pour un bagay ou fe mal. En anglais nous dit fine, okay? Fine. A victim is victim. Victim. It's almost the same word, uh, same spelling in French as English. Victim, victim. A judge. Okay, the actual person who rules the courtroom is juge. Okay, juge. Yon juge, c'est yon judge en anglais. Judge, juge. To judge is juge. Okay, it's like someone commits a crime or they're accused of committing a crime. They go to court and then the court looks at everything. That's juge. So let's say you see someone you don't know. Um, so you don't like their shirts, you don't like their shoes, and you decide that person is bad. That's Gigi as well. Gigi, c'est là nous, nous former yon opinion de, de yon moun. Nous Gigi, ok? En anglais, nous dit judge. Judge, presque même j'ai avec un Gigi, ok? Judge. A trial is jijma, okay? Jijma, like the process, the process the court goes through to judge someone is jijma, okay? Jijma, trial. Le on moun al nan jijma, nan tribunal, nou di trial, trial. Trial also means tribulation, tribulation. Tribulation vle di trial too. A violation is violation, violation. 
um, you take a red light, it's a violation. Okay, in Creole, violation. Violation, say violation. A traffic violation is when you don't stop at the stop sign, for example, you don't yield, um, and you take a red light. Okay, in Creole, violation, circulation. Okay. Circulation is the regular traffic on the road. You have cars going up, you have cars going down, people are turning left, people are turning right, people are stopping. Okay, that's circulation, regular traffic. When traffic is heavy, traffic is bad, you can only go 5 miles per hour, 10 miles per hour. We call it blockis, not circulation, blockis, heavy traffic. Circulation, c'est les machines à monter et descendre dans l'arrière, ok? Nous dit traffic, traffic. Les gens bloquent, machines ne pas aller vite. Nous dit traffic, mais nous devons dire heavy traffic. Sentence, ok? Someone is sentenced to five years in prison, ten years in prison. In Creole, we say sentence. Sentence, or you can say condamné. The person is condemned. The word sentence, okay, also means phrase in Creole, phrase. Like when you're writing, okay, if you're writing a sentence, we say phrase. Sentence, okay, ta kouan moun al nan l'état, yo bali yon sentence de 10 ans, okay? En anglais, nous dit sentence, sentence, ou bien moun nan condamné, sentence, okay? Yon phrase, c'est yon sentence too. Capital punishment is condamné à mort. Condamné à mort. Okay, the word mort also means a dead body or corpse. Condamné à mort. Another way to say condamné à mort would be death penalty. The person got the death penalty, which means capital punishment, condamné à mort. Leon moun condamné à mort. Ok, la justice condamné la mort. Nous gen wadi death penalty. Death penalty. Ou bien nous ka di capital punishment. Capital punishment. Pour mort, nous ka di dead body. Dead body, comme on a mouri. Ou bien nous ka di corpse. Corpse ou bien dead body. Pour mort. Leon moun mouri. Corpse ou bien dead body. A criminal is criminel, okay? A criminal is criminel, criminel. A violent criminal is zenglendo. So think of it like this. They're both criminals, but they're not both zenglendo, okay? Both of them are criminals, but not both of them are zenglendo. So, criminel is the guy who can grab your purse and takes your money. The zenglendo is the guy who can break into your home, he can rape, and he can kill. The word zenglendo comes from the word zenglen. Okay, zenglen is if you were to break a glass. The teeny, teeny little pieces is zenglen. And so if you think about it, the small pieces of the glass are more dangerous than the big ones because you can easily pick up the big ones and throw them away. But the little ones, you have to be really careful. Yon criminel, c'est un criminal. Yon criminel, c'est un criminal. Yon zenglendo, son moun ki violent. Okay? Son violent criminal. Okay? Criminal. A charge, okay, when someone is charged with a crime, you're charged with uh, stealing something. Accusation. It's like you're accused of doing something. You're accused of stealing. Accusation, c'est là où dit on moun fait un bagay ou accusé on moun ou dit moun nan li te vole 5 dollars, okay? Uh, en anglais, si you arrête moun nan, moun nan charge avec yon crime, li charge. Deter is décourager, décourager. Um, 
Décourager also means to discourage, okay? Deter, décourager. So if you tell someone, if you steal this cookie, I will put you in jail for 20 years. That's a way to deter that person from taking the cookie. Décourager, okay? Décourager, c'est discourage, en anglais, discourage. Mais si on moun dou, la fò yon bagay mal, sou fè sal pa vlo fè, se deter liye, deter. Civil law, ok? Civil law is loi civil. Loi civil, ok? Si na pale de loi civil, nou di civil law. Civil law, loi civil. When we talk about the court, ok? The court as a whole. We can say la justice, la justice, or l'état. Um, I'm taking you to court, okay? Ma menèw la justice, ma menèw na l'état. Courthouse, okay? The building itself, courthouse, is palais justice, palais justice. But you can also say palais justice, okay? Palais justice, ou bien palais justice, c'est courthouse. Civil court, okay? Civil court is paquet. Okay. Um, I know if you want any type of legal documents done, usually people will go to Paquet to get it done. Criminal court is tribunal. Tribunal. You kill somebody, um, you have to go to tribunal to see the judge. Okay? Tribunal. Criminal court. Um, Tribunal, ok? Tribunal, c'est là yo jige criminel, ok? Criminal court, tribunal. An arrest is arrestation, when someone gets arrested, ok? The, the action is arrestation. An arrest is arrestation. To arrest is arrêté, arrêté. If a police officer handcuffs you and puts you in the car, and takes you to jail, police arrête ou. Here's how you can use it. The police arrested him. Police arrête I got arrested. Yo te arrête m. An arrest warrant, okay, is mandat d'arrêt. The judge signed something that says you can be arrested. Mandat D'arrêt. Mandat also means power of attorney. Yon mandat d'arrêt. Les police met ton mandat. On juge met ton mandat de yon moun. Ok, en anglais nous dit arrest warrant. Arrest warrant. Ok. Uh, power of attorney, c'est mandat lié tout. Handcuff. Ok, handcuff is me not. Handcuff is me not. Ok, me not. C'est handcuff. Handcuff, me not. To handcuff, to handcuff is me noté, me noté. If the police put the cuffs on you, uh, police, me noté, okay? Me noté, handcuff. To take into consideration, like the judge takes your situation into consideration, we say prend en considération, prend en considération. Criminal law is loi criminelle. Ok? Loi criminelle. And remember, if someone is studying law, then it's droit. Ok? To bail someone out of jail. Ok? Bail is caution. Caution. I don't know if we have bail in Haiti. I almost want to say we don't. I don't think we do, but it's caution. Caution, c'est bail, bail. Ok, yon bail, son cob, yon juge faut payer, qui permet ou quitter prison jusqu'à ce qu'on retourne pour juger. Par contre, si Haïti gen caution. Lawyer, ok, lawyer is avocat. Avocat, ok, someone who studies law is avocat. Un avocat, son lawyer. 
your attorney, okay? Son avocat lié tout, okay? Your attorney, son avocat, okay? Attorney, avocat. So in the U.S., okay, in the U.S., they say lawyer and they say attorney. The attorney went to law school and passed the bar. The lawyer, maybe the lawyer didn't pass the bar, okay? In Haiti, it's all avocat. Pour avocat, nous ka di attorney ou bien nous ka di lawyer, okay? Tout de moun sa yo étudie doa, mais attorney yon li pas son test, okay? Attorney ou bien lawyer, c'est avocat. For jail or prison, we say prison in Haiti. We have one word, okay? Whether you go in for one day or 20 years, we say prison. Pour prison, pour prison, en anglais, you dit jail, jail ou bien prison, prison, jail ou bien prison. Jail, c'est prison qui est petit qui est local là. Prison, c'est ça qui est gros et pour faire plus de temps là-dedans. The word guilty, okay, guilty is coupable, coupable. They found you guilty, coupable, okay, coupable, uh, c'est guilty. Là, on est coupable de un crime, guilty. At fault, at fault, we say en tort. When someone has fault, we say en tort. It's your fault, ou en tort, okay, en tort, c'est at fault. The word innocent means innocent, innocent. Um, when someone is innocent, it means they are innocent. They didn't do the crime, okay? Innocent, c'est innocent. For not guilty, we can say pas coupable, which is opposite of coupable or innocent, innocent. Pas coupable or innocent. Si yon moun pas coupable, ou bien nous dit mon innocent mon n'a pas de fait nous gagne doit dire not guilty not guilty parce que guilty veut dire mon n'a coupable OK not guilty So thank you for taking the time to watch the video uh, we covered law in Haitian Creole um, it's a bit long but I wanted to cover everything I thought was necessary so thank you again for watching And if you have any questions or comments, uh, feel free to leave below. Uh, send me an email, and I'll try to explain if something wasn't clear. Thank you. Un grand merci à tout le monde qui te prend le temps pour te regarder vidéo ça. Dans la vidéo ça, nous te couvri loi, nous te couvri la loi. Uh, si nous avons des questions ou des commentaires, uh, fais-moi connaître. Merci beaucoup. Bye bye.